I don't know. I just did Tori's reading. That shit just kept turning off. So I just left it however it was. But this is um for Aries. Past, present, future. Unlock the magic within. Winter dream. Gestational period. Period. And a win-win outcome is forecast. Period. Today for tomorrow. Um, action. Hostilities. What the fuck? Today for tomorrow, action and hostilities. Somebody was um <laughs> taking action towards you to try to stop some type of blessing for you. But what God has for you is for you. Somebody's hostilities and actions they took based on hostilities is not gonna stop you from having a win win outcome according to what the card is talking about. This could be a person who's trying to mirror you, but they hate you though. How how much sense did that make? I'm going to see you and change my whole look, my whole everything. Base it off of you. <laughs> I'm with the same colors and everything. But then I'm going, to take, I'm going to take action against you. Why do my voice do that while I'm doing readings? Like sometimes when I got a clear, direct message that I'm saying, my voice will fuck up and I can't stand that shit. But it don't do that in, real, in regular life. But any fucking way. Action and hostility. They took action host with hostility towards you after trying to mirror you or be you. The fuck? So, or repeat you or, yeah, mirror you. Magic guardian. Unlock the magic within. So, you unlock some type of magic. Girl, that's crazy. This picture kind of looked like my sister who is an Aries who texted me today and I need to call her back. I open up to the air, two Aries cards. That's crazy. So the magic guardian unlocked the magic within. The queen of swords. Um, the knight of swords. The four of swords. So it looked like it was like a back and forth between you and somebody. And then it ended. Like you had an argument or back and forth with somebody. Then it was just silence. No communication. Could be an earth sign. Somebody you was in a relationship with before regardless of their sign or somebody who you had a close relationship with in general um some type of sadness or breakup disconnect happened between y'all so i think it has something to do with somebody unlocking their power like another person didn't like it another person didn't like that another person found their power so they had to go back and forth that has to happen sometimes for somebody to know like i'm not the one and if you, like, have a problem with who I am or my power, you can always get the fuck away from me. Or you can always not look at me. You can always move around. I feel like that's a conversation you had with somebody or y'all had with each other in the past. It was an ending. Somebody, well, the sun came before the ten of swords. It was, like, a true spoken and then an ending. Okay. So, gestational period. Winter's dream. Okay, you might be looking forward to something in the winter. Somebody might be pregnant. The Ten of Wands is here. Or you're working hard on something and you're going to see results in the winter. The Ten of Wands. What is this? The Aries. The Five of Wands. And somebody who is desperate to keep like a beef going. Like... It's somebody who is burning themselves out trying to keep a beef going. And I feel like it's somebody who's like trying to convince a person or people that they're better than them. But they keep coming back to them for something. You know what I'm saying? Like, imagine if I'm like in a mansion or some shit. And I don't like a bitch who's in the hood. She's not thinking about me. Like, she don't call me. She don't come to the rich neighborhood or nothing. Why the fuck would I take my rich ass over to the hood to go watch this bitch, talk about what she's doing, bother her, play nick and knock on her door? Just a weird ass bitch is trying to convince you that they're better than you, yet they keep coming to you to, like, they don't have nothing else to think about or nothing to do or nobody else to try to be. Definitely not themselves. They definitely don't want to be themselves. Whoever this person is, like, what the fuck? The Ten of Wands and the Five of Wands. It's like somebody making a big deal out of 
nothing or somebody's trying to tell somebody they're nothing but they're making a big deal out of them so it's hard for you if somebody's doing this to you somebody's trying to make you seem like you're not a big you're not a big deal but they're making a big deal out of you it's like they don't know that they are making you a big deal like you can't convince somebody that they're nothing but you keep making a big deal out of everything that they do and they say like that's weird the ten of wands and the five of wands yeah somebody pushed the beef to a limit where it's like I know you love me for real. <laughs> Something is confused admiration. Somebody is am admiring somebody, but because they're a hater, um, they don't want to just comment and say, oh, nice picture or whatever the fuck. No, they want to try to recreate the picture and then put in the comments, ill bitch, you're ugly. Like, that makes no fucking sense to me, bro. But that's exactly what somebody is doing. Queen of Wands. Could be another Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Gemini here. Um, what the fuck is this? Could be multiple people. Okay. Multiple people who are attached to a lover. Who are doing this. Like trying to create burdens for you. Or a lover has created like a fucked up image of you. And there are other people who are acting out of whatever this lover told them to do. A lover was like sicking their lap dogs on somebody. Or that's what they're doing. How is this shit gonna how is this affecting Aries right now? Okay, this is somebody overthinking and overanalyzing. Maybe you're having trouble sleeping or you're having dreams about a person or people involved. That would be nightmares. It says nightmares deliberate the de debilitating fear and crippling anxiety. The four cups. So I feel like it could be somebody who you haven't talked to. Um and it's causing you anxiety or you're thinking about this person who I mean it could have told you no or ignored something that you said or something or this is somebody mm -hmm, it's somebody who feel threatened who feel threatened by somebody so you can feel threatened by this ex-lover mm -mm, speech you can feel threatened by this ex-lover or you feel threatened by the people connected to this ex-lover who they use as lapdogs. This is Page of Swords. So I feel like you're trying to find out more information about a person. This could be through spying or tarot readings. What are you trying to figure out more information about this group of people? So, uh, uh, it's multiple people who are not working with you or who worked against you that you're trying to find out more information about. Or this group of people who are working against you or trying to find out more information about you. Or you're a part of a group of people who is trying to find out more information about somebody who is not working with you or the group just take out implies bro coming towards you as a win-win outcome is forecast Ooh, the magician so you're working on something in the near future that's bringing you a win okay the world so okay the world the devil So this could be you ending a cycle with the, with the devil or you're ending an addiction or a bad habit in the future. The king of pentacles. The eight of swords. 
This is somebody being bonded to something through contracts or because of money. The Nine of Cups. Okay. Somebody might be having like an alcohol addiction or a drug addiction problem. But to the rest of the world, it's like somebody trying to put on the front for the world while dealing with some type of addiction. I already saw that with the devil, but I wasn't because it says sex, obsession, addiction, enslavement. All things that make life worth living. The vampirism of the devil forces you to give in to your darkest impulses, binding you to his will. So... I don't know if you're getting a new job or new money or something or you're getting like a new opportunity to do something that could bring you in money but it also brings I'm getting more money more problems or something or it's somebody who has money but their problems or addictions make it so they can't even fully enjoy the fruits of their labor. What is this? Why is the Six of Cups reversed? It's like somebody going in circles, repeating something negative, though. If it was upright, I feel like that's reminiscing. But why is the Six of Cups here? Reminiscing about good things or something. Got the Page of Wands and the High Priestess. So you could be a high priestess. You could be someone who predicts things without cards, and or with cards, or you just have this hidden like occult knowledge, or you have a dark mystery about you. Okay, the will of fortune. Somebody's being guided to invest in something that is going to bring them good fortune, or it has the potential to bring them good fortune. It's only looking like the issue when it comes to somebody's um addictions or like a repetitive cycle what's next the will of fortune the five of cups what the fuck it's like somebody Okay, the chariot, the king of swords, the star, death, and the hanging. It's look like a situation of somebody like suddenly or sold for fame. But then it ended or is going to end for somebody who sold their soul for fame and then they feel in limbo and left with their addictions. Somebody said and feeling in limbo and left with their addictions. The, the Wheel of Fortune and the Five of Cups is like the tables are turning, but it's turning toward the Five of Cups. So somebody is enjoying something that they're doing because they're able to do it in an unfair way or in an evil way. Is somebody enjoying the fruits of something evil, but the tables are going to turn? The Chariot and the King of Swords. Somebody's hit it quickly towards like judgment, or this can talk about Archangel Michael, but then the stars here, Aquarius and death. So this is like just as publicly as somebody did something, they're also going to be shamed for that same thing, or some shit like that. Why would the star come out with death? It reminds me of like when a star busts like at the end of a star life or something doesn't they i mean don't they explode it's weird and then the eight of wands reverse is backfire energy seven of swords reverse so, so mm, somebody's gonna be allowed to flaunt some type of evil that they're doing and then the backfire is gonna be flaunted too like them getting exposed. So somebody's being allowed to do something in a big way and it's gonna be bigger when they're exposed. 
You had an eight of cups. Mm -mm, that's very weird. This could be you or you witnessing this happening to somebody else in the future. But that's weird. Let me see. Aries. Aura. Healing. Channel reverse. So, um, it's instructing somebody to heal. And what is it? this is channeling reverse, animal energy reverse. So I feel like somebody's channeling some type of animal animal energy, or um, they're channeling something that's going to eventually turn on them, or come back to collect from them, or it's like somebody's feeding an entity off the pain of others, but eventually that entity is going to want to feed off of the person doing it pain. You know what I'm saying? Through their addictions enslavement and other things so i don't know what the fuck else to say but i'm thinking this piece was just gonna be a little cute well one or two things coming between now and august but somebody reality is this and it's seduction is here okay somebody fell for the tricks of the devil and the devil's coming to collect period and then what I open up to? Accountability. That's crazy. Loyalty. Somebody's going to have to be accountable to the for the devil that they were loyal to who don't love them. Somebody lied. Nature is reversed. Somebody did something unnatural or they went against the natural order of things. And um, that's going to backfire metaverse is here i told you somebody did this shit for the metaverse or for the internet or something was willing to fuck up their real life for the internet great diviner okay legacy reverse somebody feel like pretending to be like um somebody who they're not for like a fake world It's not going to affect them, but I feel like it is. It's going to destroy their legacy or their bloodline or like the sins of the mother, sins of the father being passed down type shit. Is somebody literally cursing their bloodline for like an image or the internet or I don't fucking know people who are going to walk away from them anyway eventually like is it inevitable the two of swords but this person don't see it coming they're too blinded by the lights is what i got so i look like the type of person who never got attention in real life and they were i feel like those got to be the people who sell their soul for um something as fleeting as attention like take your biggest star they eventually you know, become what people call washed up or old or whatever the fuck, or they die or some shit. I don't know. I feel like the only people that would do, who do shit like that just don't get attention in real life, and they gotta be like a a person who don't believe in anything bigger than themselves. So that's somebody connected to you directly, like in your life, or this is you, because it's showing up in an Aries reading. So hopefully it reaches. Whoever's made for it. Thanks for watching. Bye.